All right, guys. Well, we had a nice day for about an hour, but now the doom and gloom and gray, yuck, depressing cloud has descended over the end times. Once again, on Sunday afternoon, October the 10th, uh, 2021. It's, okay, guys, it has finally happened that uh, finally happened it, that I have heard a term today that not only is nowhere in, uh, nowhere in Urban Dictionary, but if you Google this term, you will get zero hits. And I want to thank Dulcinea. Dulcinea has finally, uh, has finally come up with an original thought. Although I don't think it's an original thought. It was a thought put in her head by the person she was in the room with. But uh, anyway, okay guys, I need some help here. Uh, I will not succumb to the holding. I will not succumb to the holding. So, you look up, it's like the, the holding, uh, it's, it's either some horror flick, some, from 2010, there was some psychological thriller horror flick. I don't even want to know what that uh, was about. I have no interest in watching The Holding. So either I will not succumb to that horror flick so you go on to Urban Dictionary, and the only thing they come up with, uh, they they come up with two things that holding uh, can mean, you know, other than the regular definition of holding. I will not succumb to the holding. They they're talking about having drugs to sell to sell. You know, are you holding? If someone says, are you holding? Uh, I see that's a way of saying, do you have any drugs to sell? To, blah, 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 to sell. Uh, so I learned something. And then the other one, which I'm quite well aware of, holding uh, means you, so you need to take a, a shit or a piss. You're in bad need of taking a shit or a piss. So, I don't know if I will not succumb to the holding means I will not succumb to having to take a shit or having to take a piss. I will not succumb to having, to you having drugs to sell me. Uh, I will not succumb to some horror film, but anyway, uh, I'd like to thank uh, Dulcinea for uh, descending either uh, further into her spiral, and uh, it finally happened. I don't think it has ever happened before. Uh, although bugs in a jar, uh, we just Googled bugs in a jar last night. And the only thing that comes up from bugs in a jar is uh, some little kid's game. Uh, so not even Urban Dictionary. Uh, you can't even find bugs in a jar. Now, of course, I have just kind of uh, given that term a new spin, that bugs in a jar is a psyops operation so i'm going to see how long it takes for uh ham on little tails new uh slang bugs in a jar is ham bone for a psyops operation i'm gonna let's spread it around guys bugs in a jar meaning a psyops operation and see how long it takes for us to get a listing in, uh, in Urban Dictionary. And uh, 
Dulcinea can try to get. I will not succumb to the holding in there. I'm thinking what that is, is some sort of, she's stumbled into some sort of fucking guru kind of person uh, that is getting her to, uh, has put one of these little woo-woo sayings in her head. So maybe she's trying to exercise the demons out of her head, judging by watching and listening to her last two videos, trying to, obviously, I'm curious who the dude in the room with her is, cause it sure as hell ain't me and it sure as hell ain't her husband. But, uh, darling, I'm glad you've made a new friend. So, uh, <laughs> anyway, tick, tick, tick. Ten more days, and I will, uh, I will not succumb to the holding. I will succumb to the holding, uh, for ten more days. Uh, either the holding will hold me or the holding will cut me loose. I suggest you succumb or don't succumb to the holding. Why, well, you still can or can't. I might have to succumb to buying a jack o' lantern on my way back. Hippies buying jack-o'-lanterns. Bye, guys.